Welcome to Pulse latest product launch, the PUE product family. But what does PUE stand for? PUE is a simple shortcut for power over ethernet. Why should we use power over ethernet? Um, pretty simple. In the past, if you wanted to use an IP camera, you needed two cables. One cable for power and one cable for data. Um, it's a huge effort in installation, and if you have a mistake uh, or a fault somewhere, it is difficult to track it down. Thanks to PUE, wiring is now much easier. We have now the ability to push power in data through one cable only to the load. The load in PUE is referred as PD. PD stands for power device. Um, this is all you have to remember. So the advantages uh, we have with this technology in the field are pretty obvious. We save effort and time and cost in the installation, but also you can use the existing um, UPS in your IT infrastructure for backup reasons. How is the power injected into the RJ45 cable? How is that done? Pretty simple. There are two ways of doing it, depending on the situation you have on shop floor. The first situation is you only have AC grid available. So in this case, you can use a power supply with a built-in injector. And this injector will push the power into the um, existing RJ45 cable and deliver the power to the PD. The PD stands for power device. Could be something like an IP camera or an Wi-Fi or an access point or an access terminal. In the second way, you have an existing DC 48 volt grid available and you can connect the injector directly to this DC grid. If you don't have the DC grid, but you want to generate a DC grid to power other loads such as switches, etc., um, you can use a Pulse standard power supply. So how is Pulse addressing these two types um, of injecting power into an Ethernet line? Pretty simple, we have two products. The first product is a very solid and robust and high efficient, very reliable um, Pulse power supply with an eight port injector integrated. This eight port injector is compliant to the 802.380 standard by IEEE and uh, can directly be connected to 230 or 110 volts. In addition to that, um, we have a DC only input injector which can be connected to an existing 48 or 55 volt DC grid and will inject the power with the same compliance to IEEE 802.3 AT standard. These are the main products we have. They offer eight channel and one gigabit compliance. But how do we differentiate um, from existing products in the market? First of all, it is essential for you to understand that Pulse is not offering or selling a network switch. Network switches have a kind of receiving, processing and forwarding and routing function built in. Our devices, the Pulse PoE products, have no such function integrated. It is a very simple, just forwarding only way, which is essential if you're in um, high speed applications for optical inspection or if you're in the security um, domain, since our devices offer no access to the data. Um, so we have no data processing and we have no port forwarding. Um, it is pretty nice that we have one gigabit compliant, so there are no restrictions on the speed. But where are these type of products typically used in? Of course, in the classic IT domain uh, for access terminals, Wi-Fi um, access points, etc. Uh, but also in hospitals for nurse calling systems um, or in the security domain for civilians or in the point of service or point of sales for cash readers, card readers, etc. Um, museums, companies and schools are using PUE technology for small digital signage applications with small displays. And a very growing, fast growing market is industrial automation with uh, Industry 4.0. Um, it's all about integration. So here, um, image processing um, data and power can be used through one cable only. And last but not least, this is the most obvious one in building automation smart home, um, we'll use PUE technology as well. 
Thanks for watching this short video on PoE. Um, we're looking forward to receiving your questions and we'll be happy um, to give answers to your questions. Please feel free to contact us anytime. Thank you.